Hello, everyone. Welcome to this week's edition of Replay. I am Tim Turi, joined by Andrew Reiner. Hey, Tim. Long time no see. Indeed. It's good to be back. We got uh, Dan Reichert. Hey, Tim. And a rare occurrence here, Ben Reeves in the Replay room. That's me. Hi, Ben. Hi. Ben, what are you playing? This is Aladdin. All right. Disney's Aladdin. No, for the Genesis. Is, this is, yeah, Genesis era, SNES era, side-scrolling 16-bit platformer. So outside of the developer, like this being Virgin and Super Nintendo being Capcom, what were the big differences between the two versions? You know, one thing that I couldn't put my finger on for the longest time was that this game just looks like the movie. Like at the time, it was so similar as far as like the fluidity of the animation. I actually just read recently what probably helped that stand out is that the animation crew that worked on the movie did all the animations for the characters. Oh, that's awesome. Actually. Yeah, I didn't yeah. hear that. Yeah, it looks good. Now, was this version different than the SNES version? You know, I only played the Genesis version, so someone else would have to speak to that. I, I did play, the, I played both versions, but Indeed. I always get confused. Like, I think, is this the one that, Tim, did you play this a lot? Yeah, I played the crap out of this game. Is this the one process. that has, like, the crazy, like, genie theme, just, like, piano keys and all sorts oh, of the genie heads lamp? flying around? Yeah, it's yeah. like a genie's lamp, yeah. I remember loving that. And then the uh, the rug, the magic rug, like, going through the lava it's, stuff. It's a carpet. Gonna that was apples. a pain. Whatever it was, the carpet. Well, yeah, yeah that was hard. A, it's a pain, but it's, like, it's like a doable oh, version sure. of the battle toads, like, jet bike things. Yeah, it's, it's totally similar, was. but it's got like little indicators I think showing you. One. Yeah, they might be the same. This the Genesis has the weird kind of this. The Genesis sound chip is a little bit different. It's a little kind of bendy and wonky and weird. Yeah, and you're throwing apples in both. Ben, you got to utilize those apples. Oh yeah, we got apples. Plenty apples. Yeah, apples is a guy. Need. Look at the way the pots spin, though. Did you All see right, that? Check this out. You know what always weirded me out about the movie? It was the first time they had, like I'd ever seen like a 3D type like CGI effect in a Disney movie. Do you remember the like sand head? Yeah, that came out? The, I remember the that panther head. Yeah, yeah, the panther yeah. head. That thing that said like infidels and stuff. Like, that blew me away. That was wild. you never saw Beauty and the Beast. I did. Did that do CGI yeah, stuff? Yeah, the whole like dance scene. It was oh romantic, yeah, remember? Oh, that like stupid dancing candle thing. <laughs> yeah, guy. I hated that. That movie was stupid. <laughs> uh, That's ugh. the whole movie. It was the dancing candle. <laughs> yeah. Thing. Oh, look at this guy. Yeah, yeah, it had, like a, had like a sassy crab or Not something. Smart. That was a little, little mermaid. Can I make that jump? <laughs> that doesn't look like I can make that. Oh, uh, nice work. So I'd that... like you to do a blog, Dan, on your, just off the top of your head. We'll put you on camera about okay. your thoughts on each Disney movie. You know, right. Do a I blog know. on Aladdin camera. What's your and favorite? Lion King. Aladdin and Lion King are the two best ones. Those I know are, those, those are two well. pretty good. What did you, you think of Mulan? I didn't care about Mulan. I think I was, was getting girl. too old at that point, yeah. and it was boring. Didn't Let's have... talk about Dan's I Disney experience. I think I was 27. <laughs> for I this entire it. replay. Dan's take on Disney. <laughs> I never Dan, saw Pocahontas. That's Dan when I stopped. Does Disney. That's when I stopped on the Disney I saw Pocahontas. It was bad. Well, Mulan boring. was after. Nico was cute, though. Can I throw an apple down there? Dang it. You got to. There we go. Oh, what oh an boy. This is this a is conundrum. Not good. <laughs> so is the genie nice. lamp your health? We decided yeah. that. Yeah, okay. he's yeah. like one hit away from dying. I got no smoke left. Did you notice Shoot. what was happening when your sword oh. was clashing with another guard? Why is smoke his <laughs> life? Like, that was the controller. That wasn't me. <laughs> we could just let Ben go, actually. You could leave the just, room. Just go? He could probably I, I already went, this. actually. Oh. <laughs> oh, gosh. Ooh. <laughs> Take a break, buddy. Pass it Ooh. to Dan, I'd Look say. Look at that guy. Dan, good luck with this. Uh, you want right. to try it? Yeah. Yeah. Boy, this Genesis controller isn't that great anymore. Yeah, it it worked all right Whoa. back in the day, you but just, uh, you just edge killed that guy. I think you're going the wrong way. Hey, edge killed? Well, like you just edged him out by like moving off the screen. Oh, and I see he what you're saying. You're definitely going the wrong way. I want to get that thing. Okay, so genie hearts our lives, and then the genie head is something else. Yeah, what are we picking up here? And there's ruby. There's like a roulette thing at the end where you oh. spin a wheel. Remember that? The genie heart has a nice. goatee on it, which I think is disgusting. <laughs> Can you imagine having a goatee grow on your heart? <laughs> On your heart? Where? Just, wait, I don't that see that. That would be disgusting. Uh, he grabbed it. It was behind a pillar. And why does uh, <laughs> why does Aladdin have blonde hair in his little that health meter? Dummy. He's it's a gold statue. Really? That's, that's how they measured lives hmm. back back then. <laughs> Tell me, I'll throw an apple right back in, your face. in ancient Persia. <laughs> Prince of Persia. <laughs> this game looks <laughs> like Prince of Persia. Oh, so the music's done by Tommy Tallarico. Yeah, that guy of Earthworm Jim fame. He's done a ton of stuff. In video games Tony live. Hawk. Here you go. Here you go. Nice. That's so cool. He cuts the apples? Yeah, that's yeah. awesome. All right, here we go. Platforming. Yeah. 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 Got it. All right. Now, were apples big back then? Mm. Shouldn't mm. they have been eating prunes or something? What? 
Because, like, prunes, they were big back then. <laughs> what the hell are you talking <laughs> about, you know, what, man? you know what else I like about this game? <laughs> moving on from the prunes. Somebody help me out. Here. No one, Pru- no one, no prunes one him were out. big back then. So, moving on from, like, the prune statement. <laughs> you think it's interesting that, like, okay, so apples in the movie were, like, he, like, juggled them and, like, rolled them on his shoulders and did, like, some tricks with them for one scene when he's, like, stealing bread or whatever. Yeah. And they turned it into a huge, like, cool. element of the gameplay where you throw them all the time. Did that strike anyone as weird? I think it's cool. That's your answer? I thought it was pretty weird. <laughs> where does he keep 24 what else he apples throw? anyway? I mean, he has a sword, but then apples. Well, why did he have to steal well, bread when he had, like, 800 apples in his pocket give him, like, time? poison darts or 23. something. 23. <laughs> darts? Where am I going? Poison darts. Oh, why sure. Not? That'd be great. Or he could throw his monkey at Sand? Him. Kick sand? Just hit people with a lamp? Ooh, where's the... What's that where, head Where's a poo? He could use the lamp like a Luigi's Brrr. Mansion-style weapon. Maybe? What did the Apu head get me? Uh, I don't know. Was it Apu or Abu? Abu? It might be Abu. Apu. Is Apu? Apu Apu? Nahasa. Oh, Ooh, now you can buy that. stuff. There you, you go. Stuff. I don't know it's what that did. Deal. I got a you wish. Just... <laughs> now you're Thank out. Of, you. You're out of gems. Where are your gems? <laughs> um, I had some. They're gone now. You foolish, That's what you use foolishly for. spent them. We would have the golden voice of Gilbert Gottfried if this was a current gen game. That'd be so good. Yep. I, I saw a video with him using his real voice. Have you heard oh, that? really? No, I've never it heard of his real voice. terrifying. It sounds like a serial killer. Just he totally has normal. a real voice? It just sounds like, I'm, uh, I'm Gilbert Godfrey, and if you can really make these dates line really? up, I'd really appreciate that. Is he yeah. squinting at all Yeah, he does not sound he... like Iago at all. Maybe that's oh. his fake voice. Oh, this must be the wish that I bought. Don't go... Yeah! Oh, nice. nice. Don't lose it. Go for lose, and then yeah. you won't get lose. Oh, this is good. Oh, man, you're rocking it. Ah! Oh, oh, come on. Who voiced you. Jafar? Was it Jeremy oh, Irons? Or no, he was Scar in the Devil. The devil the voiced devil Jafar. Was... Who did voice Jafar? That had to be someone. Uh, I don't know. I just remember the kid who voiced Aladdin. Interestingly, he ended up on uh, that show, Full House. Mm. Remember that? Hanson's going to look it up. I thought it was Candace like... Cameron's. Uh... Yeah, he was dating that girl. It wasn't Kirk, wait, it wasn't Kirk Cameron? No. Oh, you're the monkey. Oh. It was Kirk Cameron's sister. So this is a bonus level. You Kirk just Cam- dodge, right? Wait, I thought Kirk Cameron voiced Aladdin. No. No? That is incorrect. No, I'm it just totally off here. from Full House. What dude from Full House? I don't know. He dated Dave Coulier? The, he dated one of the chicks. <laughs> he dated one of the girls. Now, do you guys remember He's the... Guy. He's I thought guy it was Kirk Cameron. Does voice acting. No, no. It's one of those dudes from that it's era. It's whichever. One of you guys have his, have his poster above your bed. I Maybe can't remember. Maybe it was... Somebody else. Ben, I have another question for you if yes. we're done pondering this. <laughs> Go. What, uh, do you remember the relevance of the guy. scarab? Yeah, what was the point of that thing? Did they use that to open up the the temple? I think they got the two parts and they thumbs the head up. opened up. Okay. I so Hanson's it's... giving a thumbs up to to Ben Reeves, I believe. What's his name? We're looking at um, Tim. Read it off. I'm being. Okay. I, I tried to read for Ben Hanson's actually... phone with the answer, and it was battered away like I was a child uh, <laughs> reaching for bread in a market. <laughs> <laughs> like you're kids a lad. Do your kids go for the <laughs> bread. <laughs> I usually went for candy. I like doing that a lot. That's fun. Gummy bears. That reminds me of something. What is he spitting? It's a camel spit. they spit. Do you think if you bounced on him enough, you'd dry him out? No. Why not? Spit it comes from somewhere. <laughs> I don't know if it's camel anatomically correct. Oh, do you see the Easter egg? Where, oh, what? yeah, I do. Oh, oh, yeah, oh yeah. I see it. Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry. That was just an apple. I thought it was an egg. <laughs> Tim, just knowing who you are and what you're like, I imagine you're the type that could probably sing the entire Robin Williams intro of this movie. Sorry. Like, no, no, the Disney thing. Okay. I liked, uh, I liked the Prince Ali Abi Ali Ababa thing. Yeah, yeah, I love yeah. that song, but I don't know any of the lyrics. Okay, I'm not that. Guy. I figured you whipped out Space Jam like nobody's. My business, friend Dave but... can do all <laughs> that Space stuff. Jam. Yeah, but that's Warner Brothers, not Disney. I know, I know. Now, Robin Williams, he's a huge gamer. He goes to E3 yeah. a lot. I met it, met him like three years ago. Yeah. His daughter is named Zelda. In a Starbucks oh. line. Uh, I don't like it when he does his impersonations and stuff like that. Yeah. There was a lot of that in Aladdin, but it didn't bug me. But whenever I see him do it on talk shows, it drives me insane. Yeah, like, it, I got to turn the channel. If he's yeah. on, like, Conan he or was, something, it's just a mile a minute. It's like, oh, geez. never very funny as far as stand-up goes. I saw some of it. I wasn't a huge fan. Uh-huh. But, but uh, what do you think of Dan Castellaneta replacing him in the uh, the second he Aladdin did, he movie? He did fine. Oh, yeah. He sounded exactly like him. Just, I mean, yeah. there was a little bit of a Homer twang. Was but it, how many who movies played him in the show? Movie? Uh, there, there was like three, I think. Yeah, because there was the the there was the first one. The sequel is Return, Return of Jafar. Right? Yeah. There was like Arabian Nights or something like and these that. These are direct to DVD, right? Prince of Thieves. Yep. Then they direct to VHS yeah. at the time. <laughs> the TV show. What was that called? Oh, Aladdin. Was it called Aladdin? I don't know. Arabian Nights. 
Speaking of Dan Castanella, I, I never know how to pronounce his name, but he also, I think, was Earthworm Jim on that cartoon. And Earthworm. I just saw him in Super 8. He shows up for like two seconds oh, really? in Super 8. Yeah. Does I'll that guy have man. like... How much is he money the monster? does that guy have? He's, Don't no, tell me. He's like a car <laughs> salesman or something. He was also the in Arrested salesman Development. is a monster? He was in Arrested Development. Do you know that, Tim? Uh, no. He no, is I... the doctor that always tries the experimental things, like switching the fingers and stuff. Oh, nice. And he actually says dough at one point. Oh, yeah. Like, he cuts <laughs> nice. him and he goes, dough. <laughs> That's awesome. So the voice of Jafar is Jonathan Freeman. Jonathan Freeman. I don't know who that is. Who is that? I mean, there he was. That bird Consult got naked when he threw an apple at him. Iago. You know, they gave him teeth because they felt like Gilbert Gottfried have to, had to have teeth. Like, you don't hear that voice and not see teeth. Oh, yeah. Where are you getting all this knowledge from? <laughs> That's interesting fact. My, is it a fact? My knowledge reservoir? <laughs> if I jumped on you, would your knowledge reservoir run dry? You'd uh, snap my Much reservoir. Much like a camel? Camel. <laughs> reservoir dogs, I think. <laughs> reservoir it. dogs. Do you remember Originally the... titled Reservoir Camels. <laughs> Do you remember the uh, like hidden sex thing that was a big controversy Whoa. with the, oh, the sex Wait. dust? <laughs> in the no, no, the dust the was movie? in the oh. dust was in Lion King. This oh. was it's, it's tower, right? Wait, sex it's dust. when he falls off when he's talking to Jasmine and the the carpet lifts him back up, and you're supposed to play it in like slow mo or backwards or something and turn it up really loud and it sounds like he says like good teenagers take all their clothes off oh, or something. Really? It's yeah, like I've now good that. kids take off their claws, but he's saying now like all now good kitty take off your claws. Is that what he's saying? Yeah, it, it was like kids and claws got mixed up with, you with failed, kitty man. and clothes. Clothes. Oh, okay. See, wasn't there something with the box art or the Little movie Mermaid? Poster? Oh boy. No, that one of the towers in the background. Yeah. Was that was Little Mermaid. Mermaid. That was it looked like mermaid. a wiener. Yeah, there was, yeah, there was a was spire. Mermaid. Okay. Yeah, there was yeah. also the priest had a boner in the marriage scene. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think that was kind of an illusion a little bit. <laughs> what a boner. <laughs> yeah. I mean, a boner is actually a term for a mistake, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah so technically. I gotta All start right. using it Remember, that way more. Wasn't there a kid named Boner in that oh boy. TV show starring Kirk Cameron? It's all circular. We gotta stop talking about Boners pretty quick. And Kirk Cameron. <laughs> I'm playing too much Duke Nukem around the office. Uh, so did you guys beat this game? Yes. Uh, I loved it. I don't remember. Do you remember the end? Oh do you fight, God, do you fight giant, like, demonic uh, Jafar uh, genie, I think? I kind of remember that. Okay. Yeah. He was kind of a pain. This is a hard game. Mm -hmm. Eat Fun apple. Uh, it's I, still beautiful, though. Yeah. yeah. Got him. There's too many Iagos, though. I always hate those encounters where you only have, like, a split second to get them, like, mm -hmm. as they're coming off screen. Yeah. The guy just eats. Oh, I, there he goes. I always wanted a Iago to, like, come be my friend and, like, <laughs> help me out. Sure. Yeah, no, that's, that lines up. That was natural, right? That all adds up. In the game, I mean. Oh. And in real life. Good save, <laughs> I guess. Well, he was a cool guy. I just wanted Gilbert Godfrey to follow me around. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably not that many years away hey, from Dan. doing that. Yeah. that like, yeah, how a couple long bucks. until that got old? Like, that would be... Oh, I'd love it. That guy I, cracks I, me I'd up. say, like, after a couple hours, you'd want to kill yourself. <laughs> no, he probably. cracks yeah, me just up. Just having him in the back. He, he's the soundtrack to your life. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay with it. Just narrating my life story. <laughs> narrating as you're you're writing a review. Yeah. <laughs> this is where one of us pulls out a Gilbert Godfrey impression and just realizes they can't do it at ben all. Ben kind of just tried one, yeah. but I think we talked over him. It do was, it again, Ben. No, it was bad. Oh, I thought it might have been bad, but I didn't hear Oy it. Vey. Why doesn't Dan get to work on time? No, that sounds more like a grizzled. Well, what is that? That was pretty good, actually. How does he sound? Not yours, Ben. Yeah. Oh. It's it's in your head, but you hey, can't look, replicate it There's a genie your, tent. Your can, voice. Can is that supposed move? to be an outhouse? That's is, that 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 is he doing the Egyptian, too? Um. Yeah, he is. That's he, he got one of them. The Egyptian. Wait, are you about to do the um? The there we go. There go. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that does. That's dance. that's pretty good. What what is that? Is this the uh the temple? I think with all the like all gold right. and stuff everywhere. We with the uh, lava. Oh, this is gonna be good. Nice. And then we do the uh the carpet. Oh, you right escape. Yeah. yeah, you escape. On that's that. gonna be yeah. fun. That was hard. No, that did was, you? The first level I got stuck on. Yeah, me too. In my whole life. Did you guys play Lion King or Toy Story or any of those? Yeah, Lion yeah. King was great. Toy Story yeah. was good, too. Yeah. I think those were both really solid. Those three kind of stand up to me as being, like, the definitive early Genesis games as far as, well, I guess they're both SNES and Genesis, but as far as 16-bit platformers, they go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a lot of the other yeah. ones, I think. Remember Toy Story coming out at a time, like, after Killer Instinct and Donkey Kong Country with, like, those random mm, yep. graphics and yep. that being one of those first games that really kind of pushed those systems to a new level? With yep. the 3D graphics yep. that are rendered into sprites? Yeah, they... That definitely was a good movie to use that uh, that animation style on. 
I just remember with Lion King, there's like the sequence where there was lightning going on in the background, and I thought it looked really awesome. Was that the boneyard? Yeah, that boneyard was or the, wow. yeah, like the yeah, graveyard was thing was was really good. And Simba, he was like really cute as a cub. Yeah, yeah, another one that was really well animated, like uh, <laughs> in a manly way. Who yeah, would rather see? I'd rather see Disney do. Uh, new games like this or new movies like this, like 2D side-scrolling, mm-hmm. yeah. rather than just putting everything on Wii and calling it a day now. Yeah, <laughs> like the downloadable market could, would probably benefit from some really solid platformers like this. Do you mean with like their new stuff, or do you mean like go back to old franchises like Aladdin? Both. You know, even mm-hmm. Tangled, you know, maybe it's not the best example of a game with action or a movie with action, but, you know, they put it on Wii or, or DS, you know, why not... Do something different with it on on Flutes. you know 360 PS3 and and all the other systems. Yeah, that's an interesting idea. I wonder why there hasn't been like a really good downloadable Mickey Mouse game yet. Yeah, kind of yeah. in the vein of like Mickey Mania, oh. but better or Castle of Illusion, World of Illusion. Oh, I would great. kill for that. Yeah, yeah. or Quackshot maybe. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's not even start <laughs> yeah. on Quackshot again. What, oh, what is that? The pipe story. Speaking of Quackshot yeah, and this. Pipe. Speaking of Quackshot and this, what is with 16-bit people in Windows having a surplus of pots? That happens in Quackshot, too. Just people just... Unlimited pots. I can't answer that. That's what they... They had to store the, all their apples One of those trade so. secrets. Once they were done with their apples... <laughs> Once all their apples just started the floating... <laughs> all of them have 99 apples in their houses and a pot for each of them. <laughs> One pot, apple pot. That's just apple. how they stored things back That's then. That's why nobody's upset when Link breaks all the pots. <laughs> That's true. Ooh, what is that sound? That is not the sound... It's it called a slide whistle. Slide. <laughs> Slide, a slide whistle. Slide whistle. Okay. What is that? No, that was your voice. voice. You just that did. was your voice, Ben. <laughs> yeah, but that sounded. That was like, you. Yeah, that sounded like somebody. You You're like a baby like... discovering his toes. <laughs> <laughs> a slide whistle. Weird. That's from something. Yeah. No. It's no. I, I don't know, man. It's from the Aladdin replay we did all the way back when. Remember oh that? my god, that was a good play. We didn't. Oh, you're talking. Ben, I gotta stop what is going on? listening to you. <laughs> it's not I you I've been trying to like Wait, keep you, track of this. I don't think you are listening to me. But I want so you to know that to if I wasn't hosting this episode, I would be listening to anything that you said. <laughs> what? I'm not listening. Exactly. Oh boy. I don't listen to myself. It's, That's my rule. It's good to have you on replay then. Alright. <laughs> Street comedy. <laughs> Arabian rooftops comedy. <laughs> Arabian <laughs> comedy. That's good. <laughs> Gotta take that on the road. Why are those guys just wearing their underwear? Is what I always thought. Yeah. Uh, Mickey Mouse hat coming up. You did think? you ever mm, uh, see. try wearing it on your head? Oh, are you talking about my underwear? underwear? Yeah, yeah. No, not generally. Yeah, that's what I meant. When I said yeah. it. Oh, oh I just hit the checkpoint though. I thought we were gonna get to the carpet. I really want to see the carpet. We'll mm. give you. We'll give you one more shot and see how far along you can make it to this level. And Alrighty. after that, you're uh, you're cut off. Oh, you're right. It does, right have a, there. it does have a goatee. Look at that. It's gross. Excuse me? The go- heart goatee. <laughs> the heart goatee. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh. Like, what, what if it grew too long? You know what I mean? <laughs> How do you trim it? How do you shave a heart goatee? That's, Ugh. that's what we've been asking ourselves forever. Well, can you imagine being a doctor and, like, on an autopsy table and, like, opening up someone and be like, oh my this God, is a problem. This, what is this guy? What, what is, is that guy? Is this a mini boss? What is that? I don't know. He's too tiny to be. He totally scary, freaked but he you is. Out. He reminds me of one of the thieves from um, from Golden Axe. Oh yeah, he's gonna steal your apples. Oh good. How many times have, like, you gotta repeat that strategy to see it doesn't? You're work. out of four, dude. <laughs> hey, well, I'm not getting near this little guy. Hit him with yeah, your sword. Get... <laughs> uh, it's scary. I don't want to get close to him. He looks you're dirty. in trouble now. He looks like Mario. Yeah. 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 There you go. Maybe that was intentional. Give me a thing. Now you have three apples. You can proceed right. Ding ding. Flute. You have no lunch. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, remember that guy giving me a hard there's time an apple. too. Uh oh. Oh, it's another now mini boss. Oh, like man. The real boss. Oh, That's man. harsh. Two bosses in a row. They really had to be creative with like their boss encounters in this game, considering oh, God. there's like Jafar, and like as far as antagonists go, that's pretty much it. There was like the guard. Ah. It's like Donkey Kong. He was kind of yeah, a. Yeah, it is. Dang it. Oh. Oh. That's it. I think that'll be a wrap. Pretty good look at this game. How's it still yeah. play, guys? It's fun. Yeah. It's a totally great. solid platform, yeah. All right, well, stay tuned for Roulette. Well, as you can see, we stumbled upon Captain America and the Avengers for our Roulette. Stumbled uh, into it. This is, a, this is a game and a I property that's Captain very America. near and Whoa. dear to Ben Reeves' heart slash shoulder, considering he has a very 
festive Captain America satchel? Purse. Is that what you call it? Purse. It's a purse. 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 It's, it's not a purse. purse. It's, it's a not a satchel. Well, what is it made it's out of? It's a women's purse. It's made out of Percy things. Denim. What color is featured on it? Brandon? Denim. It's and blue, blue and it's very blue. Pink. Oh, and, and made leather. Leather. Oh, Okay. Leather. We should just show a picture of it, right? It might now. be pleather. See Viewers, how, tell us what you think. See how manly it is of the purse. It's definitely. I like a, it, Ben. It's definitely a man bag. I like it. I'm gonna put my neck out there and say I like it. Any of you guys played this game before? If Captain oh, yeah. America had a purse, that would be. This, I remember, as being a really good beat-em-up slash shooter. Hawkeye, Captain America, Iron Man, they would all go into space and shoot guys. And Vision. Yeah. I used to play as Vision back before I knew he was lame. Vision? Yep. You think they'll be bringing him back for the oh, Avengers wow. movie event? Uh, probably not. Yeah. He's kind of a cool character. He, he is all right. He's not as cool as, like, Cap or, like, Hawkeye. Now, who's who here? I am Iron Man. I'm Cap. Ben is Captain America I'm naturally. I am playing my purse. And Iron Dan. <laughs> Okay, Iron Dan. What are those things down there? Are those cans, do you think? Uh, Spray cans. Burritos, I think. Okay. I must really want to like, food hungry? or something during this replay. <laughs> what the? Oh, man. That's not good. We told you, you to eat a taco Mexican before food. every episode. <laughs> Look at this. Okay, I can't remember how to throw my shield. Can you? Yeah, I used to be able to. Who's that guy? I think Dan can shoot laser beams. Yeah, I got to jump. That's whirlwind, right? Seems like. He's dumb looking. Don't disturb, disturb us. us. Why should it go to hell? What? Why should it go well? <laughs> what? Oh, oh go awesome. well. I love this oh. crap. I almost asked a question. Why that should would, it go well? I almost asked a question that would make comic fans' head explode uh, because of how stupid it is. I was about to ask if Whirlwind oh, was go. that guy from X Men First Class that had the tornado hands, but aren't those different? Well, DC, I haven't seen the movie. It's the same. But isn't uh, X Men Marvel and this is DC, right? No. What? Oh, oh my god. Wow. Yeah, whoa. They, you just did it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You were a fool. Oh, Iron Man's Marvel. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Iron Man is. Oh, yeah, because the Avengers. Yeah. So Hulk Basically is Marvel. You suck. So DC is pretty much just Batman and Superman, right? Basically, and DC Green Lantern. kind of sucks, yeah. And Hawkman. And Green, Green Lantern's the movie that's coming Woman? out, right? I, I get Green Lantern and Green Hornet mixed up. I got Those a are different things. More. Correct. Okay. Did, did Green Hornet ever exist in any comic book form? Yes. A lot. Like a heavy, yeah. heavy presence? Okay. Way back in the day. Wasn't he a radio drama, too? Yes. Oh, gotcha. That's where it started, I think. Yeah. Oh, really? Same with The Shadow, right? Or, yeah. yeah. Yep. That was a radio drama. So is this guy with the crossbow the you knows. are? Is he the guy they showed for like two seconds in the Thor movie? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yes. in the Thor movie. For okay. Because I remember people freaking yeah, out people when they showed like, him. People were like, oh, my gosh. Yeah, yeah. And I had no idea what was going on. Okay. like, why are they showing this guy? Yeah, it's so like, much. oh, it's the guy from the Hurt Locker on screen for two seconds. He didn't do anything. He grabbed a he thing didn't. and looked at a thing, and then he was gone. He Wait, did. that happened in Thor? When did hey, that, that happen in that Thor? Was, uh, he was up over. He was looking over the like site where they were keeping the hammer, and yeah. he grabbed his like crossbow thing. And yeah. everyone in the crowd went ape, and I didn't know what the hell was going on. I didn't put that together. It at was all. definitely I didn't weird. Either. If you didn't know who uh, who Hawkeye was, it was definitely kind of weird. Oh my gosh, who are these bug guys? <laughs> so powerful. They look like uh, from Turtle Two, the arcade game. Oh, he was the guy that was. He was a guard. <gasps> yeah, he was basically yeah. just a military dude. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, that was pretty unremarkable. Yeah. He was awesome. And it was weird, too, because he was, like, a known actor. Like, so it's like, why would they have this actor in this tiny role? I'm just going to keep shooting dudes. Now, I know Red Skull is the nemesis of this game, who is being played by What's-His-Face that plays uh, Mr. Smith in... Oh, yeah, And yeah. also the the New Zealand actor. Oh, this, this guy, guy has not a bad role that I've seen. He was V in V for Vendetta. Yeah, Hugo Weaving. Yeah, Hugo yeah. Weaving. Yeah, he yeah. Lord of the Rings. Awesome. Was, Lord of the Rings. Uh, Elrond. Right? Yeah. Wait, who's he playing? Elrond in? Hubbard. He's a Red Skull in the Captain America movie. Yeah, he's Red Skull. Red, Red Skull, Skull, basically just a Nazi general with a uh, Red Skull. He was yes. Neo and Hugo Weaving. That sounds. He was yeah. all those multiple Neos. Oh ben, yeah, he was the uh, yeah. Nezos. Ben, tell us who Red Agent Skull Smith, is. Right? Red Skull is uh, one of Captain America's main nemesis. Actually, Reiner might know. Like, what's his real name? Like, he was, like, the Nazi version of Captain America. Kind of. Oh, really? Or well, their attempt to make a super So, soldier. an uber soldat gone wrong? But, yeah, yeah gone wrong. Yeah. Like, okay. it was a huge disaster, and so... Target Town. <laughs> uh, I shop there all the time. <laughs> Tar Target Town. It's a dumb name. <laughs> kind of what our <laughs> suburbs are turning be. into. Yeah, True. sure. <laughs> Turn it in. Those tires are not the scale for anything. Why are there tires on a rooftop? You at all they carry them. <laughs> Who's driving it? Reminds here? me of a, I just played a Silent Hill demo and there's a there's a there's a wheelchair on top of the roof. <laughs> Raises similar questions. Far less creepy in this game. <laughs> How did he get up there? How did he get down? I love their stances. 
Wonder well, Man. That was Wonder Man, yeah. Gave us a wing. Hey, get on. Why is he Thank sitting you, Wonder like Man? That? He's like squatting. Like, he looks like Flea Man Look from he's Castlevania. He had a fire poop. Yes. It's <laughs> my classy joke for the podcast. Okay, the go. Fire play. poop. That's what was cool about this game. It's like yeah, a bunch Iron of different looks awkward. Look how awkward Iron Man looks. You try <laughs> flying in a metallic suit, Dan. You actually have... Yeah. You're better off than I am, I think. I love that the guys that can't fly just have these stupid little ships. <laughs> Is that everyone stupid. except Iron Man? Did Vision fly? Uh, Vision, Vision, Vision could fly, yeah. it, But Captain America, Captain America and Hawkeye had those dumb ships. Could fly. It's like a like a knockoff Lego ship. I don't oh, know. Oh, I got a charge shot. Turns my head into a football. So, Ben, you worked at Marvel before working at Game Informer. Yeah, I was editor-in-chief for a while. That is not true. <laughs> that isn't true. Right? Intern-in-chief. <laughs> intern. So what did, you, intern. what did you end up doing there? Uh, I was actually in the Avengers office, yeah. I worked for uh, Tom Brevoort, who is uh, kind of like the head, one of the head dudes there now. He's like second in command almost. But yeah, it was really just uh, return to artwork. It was a very glamorous job. <laughs> I think I proofed the um, letters page a couple times. That's cool. Uh, yeah. And you said the Avengers office. You if, meant Marvel? If they need... Yeah, Not Marvel. a secret... Actual <laughs> the, the actual Avengers. Uh, I was at Shield, actually. They run that operation. What is the sound effect that's, that's, that's making ship. when we hit these? Pla? P L A H? It's a comic book, man. Pla! <laughs> that's not a sound. <laughs> Pla! It's an acronym. There's Pla blah and blah. Blah! <laughs> blah! <laughs> Pla and blah! This is the most boring sound effect ever. I like it. Blah. Why is there a mustache on a it's podium? That was reminded me of Toothpaste. Oh, that's the wasp. That reminded me of Toothpaste when I was a kid. What is this thing? Wonder Man thing? Why is like Navi here? <laughs> Good old Navi. Hey, you should blow that one up again. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. I would also run and get coffee when they needed it. I think it's Plam, actually. Plam? Plam. plam. Yeah, that makes <laughs> that a little same. more sense. That sounds like a toothpaste. No, it looks like Pla. And Blam. <laughs> no, it's not Pla. <laughs> it does look like Pla. It looks like Pla. It does. It's Pla. It's Pla. <laughs> what is Pla? It's well, like... Stop saying Pla. <laughs> <laughs> is this uh, game hard, guys? Like eh, not really. What is Pang? Remember? No. <laughs> Absolutely not. We talked you, about it last night when I was sleeping. You good save, Ben. You really just salvage Wait. all the awkward moments. Street comedy. <laughs> oh boy. No, from uh, Dead Space. Oh, the Pang treasure. Yeah. And, okay. I see what you're saying. Ah. It was a treasure. I treasure those moments with you. Keep going. What so are we, we gonna hear about? any street comedy here? Maybe <laughs> Avengers. They <laughs> heard some. <laughs> <laughs> Avengers based pickup lines, maybe? Make a joke about Hawkeye's little thingy. His little ship. Thingy? It's a big thingy to me. Like a ship? <laughs> <laughs> it's a floater. Quiet laughter in the replay room. <laughs> uh, awkward laughter. Hey, it's a sentinel. Doesn't he kind of look like a purple Wolverine? No. No. <laughs> yes. yes. No, not does. the Sentinel. Hawkeye. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. <laughs> like, have you been confused? Did you work at Marvel and confuse Sentinels with Wolverine all the time? <laughs> Wolverine's really big in this scene. <laughs> oh, why? As is you can see, Wolverine's reminds me of that YouTube video where the guys or the infomercial where the guy keeps pointing at a butterfly and calls it a horse. <laughs> I remember that. Yeah. I'll, I'll I'll link it. Oh, no, Vision looks pretty cool. What is this giant? I'm like a flying Oscar statue. What is this guy? <laughs> With a and he just turns into oh, a piece of wadded up trash if you hold in B. <laughs> that was Sweet. his fate in the comic series. That's oh, his superpower? Tanky. Yeah. Trash man. Oh, gosh. His little headshot looks like uh, Silver Surfer. That game was hard as hell on NES. Oh, Silver sucks. Surfer. So I rated bad. that all the time. I don't think I ever beat it. It is so hard. We should I just thought it looked cool. Yeah. It was like, I liked it. Who is this guy? You know, that was back before you even read the comic. I was like, just looks kind of cool. Well, do you remember the old, like, Wolverine games, too, where, like, uh, you had to hit select, Adamantium like, Rage? Adamantium Rage, and the one where you go through Sabretooth's traps and stuff, and you can, oh, man, those were great. So, oh, speaking of traps, sure. do you guys feel like you're trapped playing this game, or are you actually enjoying it? I'm just hitting B. Yeah, I'm, I want to beat this thing. <laughs> hmm. Well, uh, final verdict, do you think? This is, you, would you like to see this one re-released on, like, XBLA or PSN, like, the I mean, original X-Men yeah, arcade? Play it. I mean, I figure we're kind of scraping the bottom of the barrel with that stuff now. We've got Turtles 2, the arcade game, or... Turtles in Time came out too, didn't well, this, it? Yeah. That was the remake, though. This was um, in arcades first. Well, we need Hyper Space Heist before we need anything else. We, could we have the... X-Men, okay, which yeah. was fun as hell when we played awesome. it. Yeah, we had a blast. Yeah. But, like, yeah, to line up with the Avengers movie, you think this would be, be a great. fun one for people to revisit? There was What was the one with Spider-Man as well? There was one with the Avengers and Spider-Man. I was think it was the Avengers there, and Spider-Man. Do you remember Maximum Carnage? What was that called, though? Oh, yeah. That game was hard. Death and Return to Superman. There's a DC one. I liked uh, Maximum Carnage. Do you ever play the Batman Forever one? That one is rough. That, that's the one with the, the mo-capped Batman guy, and he was fat. 
Oh, so okay. Batman's got a belly in that game. Batman. That game is terrible. Awesome, Batman. Oh, and you're fighting like there crappy was... Tommy Lee Jones. The Genesis version of like Batman and Robin, the animated show, that was actually good. Yeah, it was I great. Liked that one. The Adventures of Batman and Robin. That's what it was, yeah. Well, I would say that this is probably as good a time as any to cut this roulette short. Seems like you guys enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah I wouldn't mind seeing yeah, it come to ever. Xbox Live or yeah, stuff like that. I agree. Do it, Microsoft. All right, well, do it. Tune in next week for another episode of Replay. Thanks for watching. They called him carpet. There we go. Though. You can Aladdin do it. Called him are we getting tacos? They are tacos, right? Those are slices of apple. They really look like tacos. Are you sure they're not adding to your apple? They're tacos. They're probably pita what pockets. Are they? Are they... They're tacos. They're pita pockets. Nobody ate tacos there. My eyes are too old now, and I can't look at things this fast. <laughs> this is really your, hard. Your vocabulary is up there <laughs> still, though. Dan, you're like 25. I yeah. know. Maybe my laser eyes got botched, because this is crazy to you look at what? now. This is not that fast. If you follow the pickups, it kind of guides you a little bit. I'm going to follow the giant uh, genie hand. Giant finger? Yeah. I had no idea Jeans about any kind of game finger. design when I was a kid. Oh my it's god! It's so obvious. This is. Would have you follow your finger, or would you? Like... I just would. I would just wing it. I'd go to the middle and then go up and down. Oh Obstinately, god. be like, I don't need that. Don't tell me where to go. <laughs> Boy, it'd be nice if Battletoads had that. I would have, di I would have <laughs> died oh so many gosh, times by so now nice. when I was a kid. He's probably lying. Yeah. Yeah. Look at all yeah. the stuff you're missing. Jeez, this is really fast. You're not getting a perfect on this. I, that's not what I'm going for. I just want tacos. It's blast processing. It is. I'm sure he's full by now. Wouldn't it be great if you could get free tacos that they just floated in the air? Just Deep hop thoughts. on your magic. Oh god, the question mark. I don't hop like that. Hop on your all. magic carpet. Yeah, that's pretty free mean. taco. I'm gonna need to blink at some point. This is like rally <laughs> racing. Hard right. Just ride that radical wave. Yeah, that looks friendly. Cowabunga. Oh my god, I really am afraid to blink. How many times have you surfed a lava wave? Oh, that's that really, really hard. Jeez. That was close to the end. Yeah, yeah. Nice work. Whew, was okay. there like, there's no halfway point? This Doesn't look like it. Oh, there's no wave. That's hard. Are your eyes? We're okay now. That's a taco. All right, is that it? <laughs> and close. Here's tacos in your eye.